power generation challenges by middle of next year. End of next year. This directly signals the end of lithium as Elon Musk has just announced shocking 2026 battery updates that demolish everything we thought we knew about electric vehicles. While everyone's been talking endlessly about the Tesla Model 2, most have completely missed the revolutionary battery technology developed in absolute secrecy. Today, we'll reveal the complete mix of cutting-edge 2026 battery projects that will make lithium-ion batteries look like Stone Age technology, plus exclusive Model 2 updates you may have missed. Don't be left behind when the automotive revolution explodes in 2026. Welcome to this channel. Subscribe and turn on the bell to join the journey with our next 135,759 Tesla fans. Let's get started. A $1,095 Tesla aluminum ion battery pack might sound like fake information, but once you break down the science, supply chain, and Tesla's vertically integrated manufacturing strategy, it becomes not only realistic, but inevitable. This isn't just a price target pulled out of thin air. It's the product of years of innovation, quietly backed by Tesla's proprietary processes, global infrastructure, and bold moves no other automaker dares to make. Let's start with the fundamental science. Aluminum ion batteries operate on a completely different principle than lithium ion technology. Instead of relying on lithium intercalation, aluminum ion batteries use aluminum as the anode material, creating a three electron transfer process that's inherently more efficient. This means each aluminum atom can store three times more charge than a lithium atom, which only transfers one electron. The cathode typically uses graphite or other carbon-based materials, creating a system that's not only more energy-dense, but also dramatically cheaper to produce. The economics become even more compelling vajwas. And you consider aluminum's abundance. Aluminum is the third most abundant element in Earth's crust, making up about 8% of the planet's surface. Compare this to lithium, which represents just 0.002% of the Earth's crust. This abundance translates directly into cost advantages that compound over time. While lithium prices have been volatile, ranging from $5,000 to over $80,000 per ton in recent years, aluminum has remained relatively stable at around $1,800 to $2,800 per ton. Tesla's vertical integration strategy amplifies these natural cost advantages. The company doesn't just buy batteries from suppliers like other automakers. Tesla manufactures its own battery cells, develops its own battery management systems, and even mines some of its own materials. This approach eliminates multiple layers of markup that traditional automakers face. When you remove the supplier profits, distributor fees, and middleman costs, that $1,795 price point becomes not just possible, but profitable. But here's where Tesla's approach gets truly revolutionary. The company has been quietly developing aluminum ion technology for over three years, working with universities and research institutions around the world. Unlike the public spectacle of their lithium-ion gigafactories, Tesla's aluminum ion development has been conducted in stealth mode. This secrecy wasn't just about competitive advantage, it was about avoiding the market disruption that would occur if competitors and investors fully understood the implications. The testing progress for the 2026 Model 2 is further along than most people realize. Tesla has been running aluminum ion prototypes in real-world conditions for over 18 months. These aren't just laboratory tests. We're talking about actual vehicles being driven by Tesla employees, accumulating hundreds of thousands of miles of data. The charging characteristics, thermal management, and longevity metrics are all being refined in preparation for mass production. Tesla's proprietary battery management system plays a crucial role in making aluminum ion technology viable. The company has developed advanced algorithms that manage the unique charging and discharging patterns of aluminum ion cells. Unlike lithium ion batteries that can suffer from dendrite formation and thermal runaway, aluminum ion batteries require different management protocols. Tesla's system monitors each cell's temperature, voltage, and current in real time. Me, optimizing performance while preventing degradation. The global infrastructure backing this technology extends far beyond Tesla's existing gigafactories. The company has been quietly securing aluminum supply chains, partnering with mining companies in Australia, Canada, and other aluminum-rich regions. 
These partnerships ensure a steady supply of high-purity aluminum at predictable prices, something that's become increasingly difficult with lithium as demand has exploded. Tesla's bold moves in this space include investing in aluminum recycling technology that could make their battery production nearly circular. Used aluminum ion batteries can be recycled with 95% efficiency, recovering almost all the aluminum for new batteries. This creates a closed-loop system that reduces raw material costs over time while solving the environmental concerns that have plagued lithium-ion battery disposal. The implications for global energy paradigm shift are staggering. Tesla's aluminum-ion battery technology isn't just about cars. It's about fundamentally changing how we store and distribute energy. The same batteries going into the Model 2 can be scaled up for grid storage, residential solar systems, and industrial applications. This versatility means Tesla isn't just disrupting the automotive industry. They're positioned to transform the entire energy sector. Consider the grid storage implications. Current lithium-ion grid storage systems cost between $300 and $500 per kilowatt hour. Tesla's aluminum ion technology could reduce this to under $100 per kilowatt hour, making renewable energy storage economically viable at unprecedented scale. This price point makes solar and wind power competitive with fossil fuels, even without government subsidies, accelerating the transition to clean energy globally. The charging infrastructure impact is equally revolutionary. Aluminum ion batteries can handle much higher charging rates than lithium ion without degradation. This means Tesla's supercharger network could deliver 80% charges in under 10 minutes, eliminating range anxiety and making electric vehicles more convenient than gas cars for long-distance travel. The network effect of this improvement compounds rapidly. Faster charging means fewer charging stations needed, reducing infrastructure costs while improving user experience. Tesla's aluminum I.O. and breakthrough could indeed end China's battery empire, and the mechanism is more straightforward than you might expect. China currently dominates the lithium-ion battery market because they control much of the lithium processing and battery manufacturing infrastructure. Chinese companies like KATL and BYD have invested billions in lithium-ion technology, creating economies of scale that make it difficult for Western competitors to match their prices. But aluminum-ion technology resets this competitive landscape entirely. The raw materials are abundant outside China with major aluminum reserves in Australia, Canada, Brazil, and the United States. Tesla's partnerships with these suppliers mean they can bypass Chinese supply chains entirely. More importantly, the manufacturing processes for aluminum-ion batteries are different enough from lithium-ion that China's existing infrastructure advantages don't translate directly. The geopolitical implications extend beyond just batteries. China's current dominance in electric vehicle batteries gives them significant leverage over the global automotive industry. Countries and companies dependent on Chinese batteries face supply chain vulnerabilities, as demonstrated during the COVID-19 pandemic. Tesla's aluminum-ion technology offers a path to energy independence that doesn't require building parallel lithium-ion infrastructure. Tesla's strategic positioning in this shift is particularly clever. While Chinese companies have been doubling down on lithium-ion technology, investing in new gigafactories, and expanding production capacity, Tesla has been quietly developing the technology that could make all that infrastructure obsolete. It's a classic innovator's dilemma. The market leader continues investing in the current technology while the challenger develops the next generation. The supply chain implications favor Tesla in multiple ways. Aluminum recycling is a mature, established industry with infrastructure already in place worldwide. This means Tesla can leverage existing recycling facilities rather than building new ones from scratch. The recycling process for aluminum is also much simpler than lithium recovery, requiring less energy and producing fewer waste products. Tesla's aluminum ion battery technology is rewriting the electric vehicle game by solving the fundamental trade-offs that have limited EV adoption. Traditional lithium on batteries force manufacturers to choose between cost, performance, and safety. Tesla's aluminum ion technology delivers all three without compromise, creating a new category of electric vehicle that's simultaneously more capable and more affordable than anything currently available. The energy density improvements are remarkable. 
While current lithium-ion batteries in the Tesla Model 3 deliver about 250 watt-hours per kilogram, Tesla's aluminum-ion technology is targeting over 400 watt-hours per kilogram. This 60% improvement in energy density means the same weight of batteries can deliver significantly more range, or the same range can be achieved with lighter, less expensive battery packs. The charging speed advantages compound these benefits. Aluminum-ion batteries can charge at rates exceeding 10C without degradation, meaning a complete charge in under 6 minutes. This eliminates the main practical disadvantage of electric vehicles compared to gas cars. When you can add 300 miles of range in less time than it takes to fill a gas tank, the convenience equation shifts decisively in favor of electric vehicles. Safety improvements are equally dramatic. Aluminum ion batteries don't suffer from thermal runaway. The chain reaction that can cause lithium ion batteries to catch fire or explode. The aluminum anode and graphite cathode create a stable electrochemical environment that's inherently safer. Even if the battery is punctured, crushed, or overcharged, it won't ignite or release toxic gases. Tesla's competitive advantages in this technology extend beyond the batteries themselves. The company's expertise in battery management systems, thermal management, and manufacturing automation all translate directly to aluminum ion production. Tesla's existing Gigafactory infrastructure can be retrofitted for aluminum ion production at a fraction of the cost of building new facilities from scratch. The market positioning for the Model 2 launch leverages these advantages perfectly. Tesla can offer a vehicle that delivers luxury performance at mass market prices, something that would be impossible with traditional lithium-ion technology. The Model 2 isn't just a cheaper Tesla. It's a fundamentally different kind of electric vehicle that redefines what's possible in the sub-$30,000 price segment. Making luxury affordable through aluminum-ion technology isn't just about reduce intense. G battery costs. It's about enabling new vehicle architectures that were previously impossible. The safety and stability of aluminum-ion batteries allow Tesla to integrate them structurally into the vehicle chassis, eliminating the need for separate battery enclosures and reducing overall vehicle weight. This structural integration approach which Tesla calls battery to chassis, reduces manufacturing complexity while improving performance. The battery pack becomes part of the vehicle's structural framework, eliminating redundant materials and assembly steps. This integration reduces manufacturing costs by an estimated 20% while improving vehicle rigidity and crash safety. The economics of Tesla's democratization strategy rely on achieving massive scale with aluminum ion technology. The company is planning to produce over 2 million Model 2 vehicles annually by 2028, creating economies of scale that drive costs down further. This volume allows Tesla to amortize research and development costs across millions of vehicles while negotiating better prices with suppliers. The price point disruption extends beyond the Model 2 to Tesla's entire vehicle lineup. The cost savings from aluminum ion technology allow Tesla to offer more features and performance at every price point. The Model 3 and Model Y can become more capable while maintaining their current prices, or Tesla can reduce prices while maintaining margins.